Hello YouTube, TJ Days in Life here. Today I have another knife to unbox for you. And this one I already took out from the package. So here is the box. It's a uh, Oz Machine Company Rosewell. This one is the regular size, not the XL. So it came in with a box. Uh, yeah, let's see what's inside the box. Okay, so we have the COA car here. Uh, Rosewell uh, serial number is 3159. And date of birth is April 1st, 2024. And 63 to 64 HRC Magnica Blade. Golf Putter Milling OTI Construction. Yeah, it's another silver surfer. This one is a little bit different from my other one because this one has their plastic blade. It's uh, stonewashed screws and clip, but the blade is their plastic. And compared to my other one, uh, this one is stonewashed blade and stonewashed uh, satin finish hardware. This one is an older model. I uh, don't know if, if you can see it, but the serial number is 7796. So it's a relatively older model. And this one is 3159. So it's a new model. Um, yeah, let's do a quick comparison between these two. What's different? Uh, What's the same? Uh, as you can see, the size is exactly the same. And the melding looks the same to me as well. And this pivot screw is stonewash, and this one is stonewash but satin finish. And as you can see, there's some difference between the club. This one is contoured a little bit. This one is flat. And the blade finish is different. As you can see, this one has that stonewashed finish on it. And this one is zero blasted. Almost feels like a, a vapor home, but uh, super cool, yeah. And what I notice is this zero blasted finish on this blade hides fingerprints very well. Take a closer at this blade finish. Stunning. Oz Machine Company uh, really did a fantastic job on their zero blasted finish. See the difference. Yeah, another difference uh, I found out is if you compare the spine of the blade, you can see the difference there. This swatch here is thicker on the older model and it's thinner on the new model. And also, uh, if you compare it like that, you can see here the swatch is a little bit narrower and this one is a little bit wider. Just a little bit. So that's that's all the differences uh, I can find on these two silver surfers. Um, yeah, let's do a quick size comparison between this one and some other knife. Uh, let's do a quick comparison between this Rob Johnson Cedar. When open, the rosy is a lot shorter than the Cedar, as you can see, which makes this one super EDC friendly 
how about compare it to the tactile knife co uh, archer As you can see the archer is longer as well okay let's do another comparison between the regular size and the XL As you can see the XL is so much bigger than the regular Okay, now let's do a weight test on this uh, newer model, Rosie. I, I'm really curious to see the difference between the older model and the newer model. Okay. This one is 2.967 ounce. This is the newer model. Okay, put it here. How about the older model? See how much this weighs. 2.967. So exactly the same weight. Let's weight this again. 2.967. Yeah. Super cool. So the older model and the new model, despite they have some minor difference in like clip and on the on the blade they have the same exact weight. That's pretty cool. Okay, that's it. So in this video, I showed you uh, a few differences that I found out about uh, between the newer model and the older model of the Oz Machine Company as well. And I hope this is helpful. And yeah, thank you for watching. And I hope to see you in my next video.